This video will show you how to replace the carburetor in your Champion 4500 Watt Plus wireless remote start inverter. Make sure the engine is completely cool, remove the side access panel, disconnect the battery, and disconnect the spark plug cap before working on your unit. Step 1. Fully drain the fuel from your carburetor into an approved fuel container by loosening the drain screw at the bottom of the carburetor with a flathead screwdriver. Step 2. Remove the small access panel on the other side of the unit, and remove the two Phillips screws on the top of the panel. Then remove the two Phillips screws holding on the recoil handle, and collapse the handle through the hole to fully remove the side panel. Step 3. Locate the throttle wire connector and disconnect it from the control unit. Then use a 7mm wrench to remove the two nuts and bolts holding on the remote control module. Reposition the module and disconnect the choke wire connector. You may need to cut a cable tie to free this wire. Step 4. Locate the air cleaner and move the fuel vent line out of the way for easier access. Beneath the air cleaner there's a hose clamp. Loosen this clamp with a Phillips screwdriver. Undo the three clips on the air cleaner and pull back the cover to remove the two nuts with a 10mm socket. Unclip and detach the breather tube from the valve cover and remove the entire air cleaner assembly along with the breather tube and any gaskets. Step 5. Behind the carburetor there is a small wire clip. Remove the fuel line and the two wires from this wire clip. Then slide the carburetor off the studs and locate the fuel line. Use a pair of pliers to detach the fuel line and fully remove the old carburetor. Step 6. Take your new carburetor, reattach the fuel line, and secure with a clamp. Replace all gaskets in the correct orientation and slide the new carburetor onto the studs. Then feed the throttle and choke wires back to the opposite side of the unit. Now follow these steps to reassemble your unit. Reattach the choke wire to the remote module. Reposition the module and tighten the bolts and nuts to hold it in place. Then reconnect the throttle wire to the control unit. Replace the air cleaner gasket. Make sure the back clip on the air cleaner assembly is fastened. Replace the air cleaner in the inlet pipe and on the studs and replace the breather tube and hose clip. Tighten the air cleaner nuts with a 10 mm socket. Fasten all three clips and tighten the hose clamp with a Phillips screwdriver. Replace the vent lines into the holes on the bottom of the unit and reconnect the battery. Pull the recoil through the hole in the side panel, replace the two screws, tighten the side panel screws and replace the small access panel. Lastly, reconnect the spark plug cap, replace the side panel and tighten the Phillips screws. Your carburetor replacement is complete. Always follow the safety guidelines in your operator's manual, and for more help guides, visit the Champion Help Center at help.championpowerequipment.com.